Hey peeps, it's Andy Kuhn with fcproducer.com. Thanks for checking out this review of Singular Software's Dual Eyes. Now the reason why I wanted to check out Dual Eyes is simple. I use their sister software, Plural Eyes, in Final Cut Pro and had tremendous success with it. So they came out with a standalone application that does a very similar as Plural Eyes. But since you don't have to use it in Final Cut Pro, you can actually take the footage, your video footage, and sync up the external audio footage from another file and it will automatically create a new video file with the synced audio and the video audio in there as well. And I'll show you how it's done. It's real cool. All right, so in Dual Eyes, here we're going to, this is what we're going to do. We're going to click on New Project. I'm going to call it Drew since I already had it open. Yes, replace it. So in Dual Eyes, it's really simple. All you got to do is drag the footage and drop it. Since I'm not using multiple clips, which you can do, I'm only using one one video file right here and one audio file bring it in and you could do that or hit the plus sign and if you need to get rid of one you just hit the minus sign so i have my two files in there and in options i'm going to make sure that replace audio for move files is checked because that's what i want to do i want to replace the audio in my movie file so only thing you got to do is come in and click the scissors and it's going to extract and uh we'll fast track it because it takes a little while and we'll be right back. Okay, the file has transferred and you can see that it finished one file produced, zero files not synced, so everything worked out great. Now the good thing about this, it tells you where the file went to or what the file's name is. So it said drew.move from drew.move and the audio file stays the same because we didn't sync up the audio or chop it up or anything else. So I'm gonna go to the folder where it created it or put it at and it's right here and there's the drew move from drew move. I'm going to grab this and I'm going to just drag it and drop it in Final Cut Pro. It's kind of just like importing it the cheap way. And I'm just going to bring it down the timeline and just drop it. And yes, match the settings. So once it's on the timeline, you'll see that it has three audio tracks. And I'll just extend that. The three audio tracks are important. Let's listen to it and just hear what the final results are. Packed house. Um... And, uh, you know, I was... I... Now, when you listen to it, you can hear the echo, you can hear the original movie file, and it's just like, what the hell happened? I didn't want that. Well, calm down, don't panic. It's really cool what this, um, what this plugin does. It actually leaves the original audio file on the top clip. So when I just silence or mute the top clip, then I can listen to the rest. I was uh, approached by, uh, by Andy. And that's what it has right there. There you have it. That's the synced version. And it does it all for you and puts it in the clip. So all you got to do is just import the movie file and you have it. You don't have to go through the sequence or anything else. So it's really easy to use. And I'm glad that they leave in the first part because, I mean, if you're shooting a live show, let's say you get a nice board mix and your camera sounds good, but it's not, you know, it's a room, to, room mic with no clipping. Then you kind of, you can mix the two if you want. So it's there if you want it. Um, but I don't want it. So I'm just going to go ahead and delete it and it leaves the sync file. And then what I'm going to do is I'm just going to select the two. So it's one file now and now I could use it and edit and do whatever I want and chop it up. So that's it. That's dual eyes. So simple to use. It's easy. It's great. There's a 30 day free trial. So go out, use it and experience it. There are other ways you can use this too. dual eyes. If you go to their website, their support is awesome. That's the one thing I didn't show you. So if you go back and you go to dual eyes, you go to the help and go to dual eyes help. It goes right to dual eyes and it shows you exactly everything that you need to do. It shows you how to open files, how to sync all the different sync options. Most of the time, I'm just going to be using replace audio for move and AVI files. It's a game changer, just like their sister product, Pluralize. If you have those two in your audio tool or in your editing toolkit, you are looking towards the future, and it's a great product. I highly endorse this product as well. So this is Andy Kuhn with FC Producer, and I'll check you the next time when I review who knows what. We'll see you then. Bye, peeps.